John Burton established his coffee and tea business in an era when few disabled people managed their own businesses and coffee was barely on our collective radar. John's family was an original importer of bulk choicer and bell tea into New Zealand. 21 years ago, John was diagnosed with Marfan syndrome, a genetic disorder that affects the body's connective tissue. The same year, he underwent heart surgery. While recuperating, he hatched his plan for his own business, importing Dilma tea. Complications after a second heart operation left him paralysed. When I woke up um, paralysed, I had no idea this was going to happen to me, as all of us don't. And I had a family, five and three-year-old, a wife, and so I just, my business was all going well. So I just decided then I've just got to get on and get, get going on this and, and not, not look back, look forward. John boxed on with a fresh venture, launching the cafe brand Columbus Coffee. The first one opened just after I'd got out of the spawning unit. So we got another shareholder in and he's just uh, taken us from sort of three cafes to 62 cafes now.